Hey everybody, George here, and today I'm going to show off my new laptop. That's right, if you've noticed my last few videos, uh, the ones that weren't a year ago, um, have had a ton better quality than the uh, my old Minecraft videos, and that's because I recently got a new laptop. Instead of my old crappy uh, three-year-old Acer laptop that I had back in the day that was never even good when I first bought it, um, I have a Lenovo Y50, which is, um, if you know anything about computers, uh, it is an amazing gaming laptop. Let me show you uh, what my frames are right now. I'm currently recording with really high settings, so a, hundred, a little over 100 FPS average is going on right now. Um, that is really good, considering I have maxed out settings. Um, I am using Optifine to enable uh, multi-core um, capabilities with the processor because it is an 8-core processor. But you can see I have fancy graphics, 16 render distance, that's the max for normal Minecraft. Um, Optifine gives you the, the um, option to go up to 32, which isn't maxed. That's beyond maxed. Um, uh, smooth lighting is on maximum, level 100%. Um, let's see what else, what else? I've got all my, well, these are extra things that aren't part of normal Minecraft. You've got, um, other Optifine things. Everything's on max. You can see, uh, translucent blocks are fancy. Um, all that jazz. Got all of the particles on, all of them. Um, and... You can see we have the uh, the graphics set to 1920 by 1080. So Minecraft is playing in 1080p, and I'm still getting over 100 frames. Uh, this is a newly loaded world, so it um, it plopped me right here in the middle of this village. Um, you can see I have a dark forest, which should increase lag. Uh, all sorts, of, all the transparent blocks with the leaves increase lag. So um, I would be getting more frames per second if I weren't looking at those trees over there and over there. Uh, we also have extreme hills biomes, which means there's more to render, more lighting updates, all that. Um, I also have my recorder, my video recorder, recording on uh, beyond the settings that I normally upload to YouTube with. And I always record beyond the settings that I normally upload to YouTube with because um, I just like having a better quality um, recording for myself on my computer that I can edit with. And I do upload small clips in that quality, but if when it comes to big clips, my internet just can't handle it without going like four days for one, one episode. Um, but the Lenovo Y50 is an amazing computer. I just checked the task manager and um, it, my CPU is only operating on 30% and that's with Minecraft running at over 100 frames. Um, that's with my recorder going and that's with my settings being high on both both things so uh, I do recommend the Lenovo Y50 for Minecraft play if you're a serious Minecraft player um, I wouldn't get the computer just to play Minecraft though it's a little overpowered uh, I would recommend getting a Lenovo probably Y5 uh, 410p or Y510P because they're both really good gaming laptops, but they're not quite as expensive as the Y50. Uh, but that being said, the Y50 is an amazing computer if you're going to be doing um, any heavy duty recording or uh, you really, really need those 100 frames for, for some reason. Um, and beyond that, it is future proof. So, I mean, the next couple years, the Y410, 510 might, be go, might go out of. Um, go out of style, but the Y50 will be um, a top gaming computer for the next couple of years at least. Um, so yeah, that's about it. Um, I have on my other channels, my other YouTube channel, which is uh, Brain of JT, if you want to look that up, uploaded a unboxing video of the Y50 and a boot time video of the Y50. Uh, but this is the, this concludes the Minecraft benchmarking video of the Y50. And um, I encourage you to check out the link in the description. It's just a link to the Y50 on the Lenovo webpage, um, and it automatically applies EQ ponds and stuff like that that they have 
going on. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.